my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ. As the shadows of Good Friday fall upon us, our hearts may feel heavy with sorrow and contemplation. We witness the darkest hour of human history, where the Son of God, our Savior, hangs upon the cross. Yet even in this profound darkness, a glimmer of eternal hope remains. Today, we are called to reflect on the immense sacrifice of Jesus Christ. His boundless love for humanity led him to endure unimaginable suffering, to become one with our pain and brokenness. In this act of ultimate selflessness, he reveals the depths of God's mercy and the promise of redemption for us all. As we, the elderly and grandparents of the Philippines, contemplate the cross, we may be reminded of our own trials and tribulations, the burden of years, the loss of loved ones, and the challenges that accompany aging can sometimes feel overwhelming. Yet, it is precisely in these moments of vulnerability that we can draw the greatest strength from Christ's example. The cross, a symbol of suffering, paradoxically signifies the ultimate triumph over it. Amidst pain, Jesus offers us forgiveness. In the face of despair, he shows us the path to eternal life. As we age, let us not succumb to bitterness or resentment, but rather embrace the transformative power of Christ's sacrifice. May we allow our trials to shape us into beacons of love, compassion, and wisdom for generations to come. The story of Good Friday does not end in darkness. The resurrection, the glorious Easter morning that awaits us, is a reminder that even in death, there is life. Even in our deepest sorrows, there is a promise of unimaginable joy. Let us carry this hope with us as we journey through our twilight years. May we be a source of light and inspiration for our families and communities, living testaments to the enduring love and grace of God. Let our lives be a constant prayer for the world, a prayer that echoes the sacrifice of our Savior. My dear friends, as we await the glorious Easter celebration, let us fix our eyes on the cross and find renewed strength, purpose, and peace. May God bless you all in Christ's love.